Chapter Four: Cain and Abel. Adam lay. Adam lay with his wife Eve, and she became pregnant and gave birth to Cain. She said, "With the help of the Lord, I brought. I have brought forth a man." Later, she gave birth to his brother Abel. Now Abel kept flocks, and Cain worked the soil. In the course of time, Cain brought some of the fruits of the soil and offered them to God. But Abel brought fat portions of some of the firstborn of his livestock. The Lord looked in favor of Abel and his offering, but on Cain and his offering, he did not look in with favor. So Cain was very angry, and his and his face was downcast. Then the Lord said to Cain, "Why are you angry? Why is your face downcast? If you want, if if you do what is right, will you not be accepted? But if you do not do what is right, sin is crouching at your door. It desires to have you, but you must master it." Now Cain said to his brother Abel. Let's go to the field. And while they were in the field, Cain attacked his brother Abel and killed him. Then the Lord said to Abel, "Where?" The Lord said to Cain, "Where is your brother Abel?" "I don't, I don't know," he replied. "Am I my brother's keeper?" The Lord said, "What have you done? Listen, your brother's blood cries out to me from the ground. Now you are under a curse and driven, and driven from the ground, which opened its mouth to receive your brother's blood." From your ham, when you work the ground, you will no longer yield its crops for you. You will be a restless wanderer of the earth. Cain said to the Lord, "My punishment is more than I can bear. Today you are driving me from the land. I will be hidden from your presence. I will be a restless wanderer of the earth, and whoever finds me will kill me." But the Lord said, "Not so. If anyone kills Cain, he will suffer vengeance seven times over." Then the Lord God put a mark on Cain, so that no one would, up, so that no one who found him would kill him. So Cain went out from the Lord's presence and lived in the land of Nob, east of Eden, a city, a city, and he, wait, Cain lay with his wife, and she became pregnant and gave birth to Enoch. Cain was building a city, and he named it after his son Enoch. Enoch was born in Irad. And I. Enoch was born. I to Enoch was born Irid, and Irid was the father of Mahuel, and Mahuel was the father of Mitsual, and Mitsual was the father of Lamech. Lamech married two women, one named Ada, and and the other Nizal. Ada gave birth to Jabal. He was the father of those who lived in tents. And raised livestock. His brother's name was Jubal. He was the one who plays the harp. His father of all who play the harp and flute. Jizal was the son. Jizal ha also had a son, Tybal Cain, who forged all kinds of tools out of bronze and iron. Tybal Cain's sister was Nara. Ada and Zara, listen to me, wives of Lamech. Hear, hear my words. I have killed ma a man for wounding me, a young man for injuring me. If Cain is avenged seven times over, then Lamech is sev then Lamech seventy-seven times. Adam lay with his wife again, and she gave birth to a son na and named him Seth, saying, "God has granted me another child in place of Abel, since Cain killed him." Seth also had a son, and he named him Enosh. At the time, the men began to call on the name of the Lord.